lives. Are you surprised um, at uh, the president's uh, handling of California issues? Because he seemed to have an opportunity to shoot down some pretty big projects. The electrification of mm -hmm. the Caltrain line, it's a $600 million project. Um, he could have done some things on environmental issues uh, pertaining to uh, vehicle emissions in well, California. Well, he's doing that. That's his fight. He's trying to do that. We have to fight that as far as the president is concerned. And as far as the electrification of the Caltrain, you can chalk that success up to the 39 Democrats in the Congress who fought the 14 Republicans from California in the Congress to get that. That was a, and we, I had it put into the appropriations bill. So this was uh, uh, something that served the community. Uh, it would have been a big mistake for him to backtrack on it. I'm not even sure he even knows about it. We're waiting for his infrastructure mm -hmm. agenda. We're waiting for his, uh, his legislation that relates to uh, reforming the tax code. We were hoping to work together with him on that, reducing the corporate rate, closing special interest loopholes, having a fairer tax uh, and more transparent tax code, and uh, with a strong middle class uh, tax cut. Everything we have seen so far, though, with the president has been about uh, tax cuts for the rich. In fact, affecting California very directly is the Affordable Care Act. President uh, uh, Bush has come out against that, as you know, mm -hmm. and he has, and it is not even a health care bill. The Republican bill is not even a health care bill. It's a tax, it's a tax bill disguised as a health care bill mm -hmm. and wreaking terrible uh, damage on, on California because it uh, attacks uh, uh, covered California, which is so successful. So he hasn't been our friend in California on that. He hasn't been our friend in California on climate. The health care.